Yo, what is up YouTube, it's Dark Fang here, back with another Paladins video. In this video I'm going to talk about 5 more types of people in Paladins. Only difference is, I'm going to add some, um, some like Aziz from the comment section of the last video I did of this, and some of my own. I may do more Aziz if you guys think, like, you can think of any other types of players. If you can, just put, after watching this video, put it in the comment section, people I've missed. Um, make sure you watch the first video, links will probably be in the description. And with that said, let's get on with it. Alright, so let's start this one off with uh, one that didn't make it into the last video. And that was one that was said by one of my friends named Cage. And basically he said that the squeakers, pretty much. Now these are the people who leave their um, voice chat on in game and start screaming the mic every time they die or get a kill or lose the point or win the point. They'll just be screaming the mic like yes or no but louder and like more squeakier. And they'll be blaming you for like playing bad but even though it's their fault for making you lose concentration with just them screaming in your ear. But at least what we can do is just mute them and everything will be better. Alright, so the next one was written in the comments of the last video by uh, someone named Shelf, and they said the player who, like, the type of player who goes to Knessa and just snipes, like nothing else, I like to call these people the lousy Knessa campers. But um, what Shelf means is that they don't use any abilities or even their, like their normal gun, they just stay scoped for the entire game and just shoot. No teleports, no mines, no nothing. They just stay scoped. They're just flank bait, like, they just wait for flanks to go. They don't even put um, oppressor mines behind them to slow flankers down. They just scope and kill, while the other Knesset is just freaking headshotting everything down, putting oppressor mines, slowing us down, but we just got that lousy Knesset up there doing nothing. So yeah, don't do this, and if you do this, just don't play Knesset ever. Alright, so next we have one I saw of, that uh, I saw of while I was in game, is when people spam in the chat, need healing, after they already died. I call these people the v VHS spammers, because you know, VHS is need healing, it the uh, thing. So basically, these people will just spam in chat, need healing, which will trigger you to look for them. But then when you try and find them, you find out they're already dead. This happened to me once, I was like, with the ruckus, I was Ceres. And the ruckus, every time he died, he was like, need, spammed in chat, need healing, need healing, need healing. I panicked, I was like, looking for him so he don't die. But then I just realised, look at the top, you know, with the, um, everyone's placed. And it's, he's dead. Like, it's so annoying, you just like, but I can't believe I fell for it so many times. Every time I went need healing, I was like, oh god, where is he, where is he, where is he, I'm gonna heal him. He's already dead. It's just so annoying. If, just, if you stay dead, if you're dead, just stay dead. And don't spam need healing, please. Alright, so next we have the Ear Rapers. These people blast music in voice chat and have like a mini party going on in the background of their video, of their like game. And they just don't mute their mic, they keep their mic set. They think everyone wants to listen to them, their little party and their emo screaming music to everyone in game. I mean, if you like emo music, that, okay, I, I don't care. But if you're blasting it through VC, just, just get out. Like, I was in a game once and like this Willow, I think it was by accident actually, but uh, they left their like voice chat on and you could hear people arguing and music and partying and it was so annoying like I'm here to play not listen to your freaking mini party just so annoying and again at least we can mute them that, that that's always good Alright, so finally we have at least one good type of person in all of these videos, at least try to have. This one was commented by Max Ribberlink, I think. 
yes, on the last video, and they said the ones that aren't toxic, that don't have any mains, they'll pretty much just go with what the team needs. I like to call these people the perfect players. Yeah, so we've got to have at least one good person, just like in the last video. Um, they're the ones that when you get into like a match, and like, they're like the last person to choose, and I don't know, they were on a chat, they were on a chat like, I want to play like Drogos or something, but they go healer, because your team needs a healer, and they're just nice like that. And in games, they're not toxic, they work with a team, and like, let's just say you want someone like this in your team, they're like the best person, they'll be active in chat telling you, like, it's just, it's really good. So, anyway, well that was five more people in Paladins. Hope you all enjoyed the video, leave a like if you did. Comment players that I've missed out, and so we can do another video on these. This won't be a daily, it's just if I get comments on this video, because the last video did actually quite well, and we got two comments there. Let's get some more comments on this one, um, and we'll make another one. Uh, sub for more, share the video, click the bell button to get notified of the video, join the Discord, links in the description, you want to join that, and I'll see you in the next one. Wow.